I'm Sylvia. Transitioning your baby from the breast of the bottle to a sippy cup is a process that most moms go through by the end of the first year and entering the second year of the life of their child. It will depend on your child. When you notice that your child has developed sufficient motor skills, it's a good time to start. For me, that was around nine months. And the perfect time for me to start was at, around lunchtime, when was the perfect uh, meal for my kids to be playful and try new things. For me, a good sippy cup has to have uh, four main characteristics. Uh, one, it needs to be lightweight, uh, it needs to be uh, leak proof, it needs to be BPA free, and it needs to be really easy to clean. I found that Thermos Fugo Face and Sippy Cups really fit the video what I was looking for. The first one is this, it has a soft spout which is very similar to the nipple and the barrel of the breast. So it was like a lightsaber for me, uh, for my kids, they, they take it really easily. Um, and after that, they graduate to this one, which is uh, the one with the rigid spout. Another feature that I found really convenient is the ability to interchange the lids. Uh, for example, my kids really like the soft spout, but when I'm out and it's hot, I need cold milk, which a stainless steel container would be better. So the only thing I need to do is just take the lids from one to the other, and that's it. I have cold milk. I think it's important to show your kid how to use a sippy cup. When I introduced the sippy cup to my kids, they really didn't know what to do with it. They actually started playing with it, which is okay. It's a good way to, for them to get used to the new object. Uh, so I sat in front of my kid and I showed him how to raise his hands uh, so he knew exactly how to do it. I found that replacing one meal at a time really helped my kids to get used to the sippy cup. The first meal and I replaced was at lunchtime because it was the easiest. And after that, I replaced the one in the morning and I leave the, uh, the feeding at night last. Some kids will prefer to uh, go for the cup with the straw instead to go with the sippy cup with the soft spot or red spot. And that's okay. Uh, actually, most kids think it's pretty cool. And uh, I think this is very, very hygienic because um, it gets everything contained and opens and closes really easily. Uh, but any way you do it, just be patient with your child, take it easy, and uh, they will do it.